Not many high school students are fortunate enough to have what we have, the school store, also known as Raider Retail. The school store is run by students in the Life Skills Program and the staff members such as Ms. O'Neill. Raider Retail benefits students by providing healthy options such as protein bars, energy drinks, low calorie snacks and breakfast options. How does the school store benefit you? I get to eat mac and cheese every day. How often do you visit the school store? Every day. How does the school store benefit you? Uh, if I'm thirsty, I won't be anymore because I'll get something to drink. Very good. How does the school store benefit you? Well, if I have gym or something, like after I'll get a Gatorade and that like helps me, you know, add the electrolytes in here, so. What's your favorite item to purchase at the school store? Probably uh, something to quench my thirst. What's your favorite thing in the school store? Probably the mac and cheese. What's your favorite item? Mac, mac and, and cheese. <laughs> my favorite items are the Cliff Bars and the Energy Bars. They're like amazing and they're like a dollar. The school store funds not only Ocean City High School students, but the students in the Life Skills Program. In the school store, students from the Life Skills Program learn the responsibility of having a job while interacting with their fellow peers. The Life Skills Program is a program for special needs students that integrates functional skills as well as academic areas. So they are prepared for transition into adulthood. We sell a lot of energy bars, the cliff bars, the power bars. We also sell some breakfast foods and a lot of times the iced teas and the drinks go over well. What's your favorite thing about working in the school store? We, we fed the drinks. Restocking the we, drinks? Restocking the drinks. What is your favorite thing about working? Um, it's about like, um, organizing drinks and snacks. Thank you, Raider Retail, for being the best kept secret of Ocean City High. This has been Abby O'Boyle reporting for the Current OC.